ladies and gentlemen, the sister I'm about to bring up to the stage, she's been defined as revolutionary, definitely going against the grain. Give it up for Naima J. play this game no more. They got me putting on an image that don't really, don't really suit me. See, on the page, that's where I get to be me unapologetically. God's work doesn't judge me, so I write. I write to remember all that was and all that wasn't meant to be, like the jobs I never got. Like the slams I couldn't rock cause my poems weren't hot. Just some well plotted topics that solicit no nods and no applause. Close but no cigar. I write for a father that never hugged me. Tied my tongue with rhetoric but now these ideas fall free. I pen desire to paper so that each word is a declaration of the success that I've been promised later. Cause somewhere, somewhere between Anakin and Darth Vader, this dark side keeps calling me. Cause I'm afraid that if I do the right thing, this right and thing will have me waiting on tables, waiting for things to happen. But y'all, if I ain't writing, I ain't happy. But uh, sometimes it, it happens and I get caught up in happenstance. Resting on pages, trying to avoid wrinkles in my cover. So many years spent living undercover, cause my vision wasn't clear enough to see these gifts that I got. So when opportunity knocked, my skeletons kept the door locked. But once I learned that Pete rocked, I had to let the beat stop so I can face the music. Cause these spirits I'm in tune with kept telling me that my faith needed tuning and only God had the key. So the Holy Spirit started humming to me. Let me know that I'd be okay, cause I been anointed with humility. I've been growing like weeds, but still my, my soul needs pruning. Especially when I start questioning myself, wondering why I'm still doing this. Moving with the movement that can't move miss, cause truth don't make sense. But I got a sixth sense, it'd have been six since I got off the fence and chose a side. Planted my feet and let my passion rise. In blue, black ink, I was baptized, dunk three times before I realized I'm bigger than any negative energy any enemy can send to make me cry. I write so that my kids won't sleep. No, they'll just have to close their eyes and dream. God has called me, and he let me know that this must be my calling. He proposed that I walk this path with my head high and my doubt closed so I don't stop every time I get to a bump in the road. I got poetry. I got poetry in my limp notes. I breathe in bros. I dream it. I sleep it. I eat it. So for me to put my pen down would be like me giving up admitting that I've been defeated. But there's a God in me. I said there's a God in me. And she's conceited. So we don't give up. We get up each day knowing regret can be misleading. So even when optimism has been depleted, y'all, we right. Cause round here, we more than poets. We're leaders. Peace.